Hey, I'm Kenny with Russell Tree Experts here to talk about the three cut method. Now, what is the three cut method? Maybe first start off by reading an article that was just published by Mike Wilson. He's an ISA certified arborist here at Russell Tree Experts, but he's a little camera shy and he asked me to cover for him in creating this video. I'm the marketing director here and so I'm going to use his tips and tricks on how to do the three cut method to remove a branch. So pruning. The goal of this video is about pruning one limb, not the whole tree. You're a homeowner. The goal here is not for you to learn how to have to climb a tree and prune all these dead limbs out of this tree. That's too dangerous. You need to call a professional arborist to come out and do that for you. But you're more than capable if you have a handsaw to be able to cut one little limb off that's in your way that maybe is blocking you when you're mowing every time you get hit in the face when you're mowing your lawn or your car hits that limb as you're driving into the driveway. And uh, there's a special way to do that, and it's pruning. It's not trimming. Pruning is when we make tactical cuts that will promote proper growth for that tree going forward. It will compartmentalize that off, and it'll keep on growing and be very healthy in the future. Trimming is just lopping off the ends of, of limbs and not being smart about it. So today, I'm going to show you how to properly prune using the three-cut method. All right, so first, get yourself a handsaw. You can buy one of these at your local home improvement store. They're not that expensive and they come in a lot of different sizes. I like this one for my home, personal home use because it folds up and little kids can't cut themselves, which is great. So get yourself a handsaw. This is one of the most common injuries in our industry is handsaw injuries because you think that it's, oh, it's just a handsaw, it's not gonna hurt you. But be very careful, those are very sharp blades. And even though it's not a chainsaw, a lot of injuries occur with the handsaw. Now moving on to the cuts. So. The first cut is the undercut. It's about one to two feet away from the beginning of this branch. I'll get through the details here in a second, but one to two feet away from the beginning of the branch is where you're gonna do your first cut, which is also known as the undercut. All right, the first cut, the undercut. I'm gonna go about a third of the way in. All right, so we got that first cut, the undercut done. That's to prevent peeling. This limb, if we didn't do that, it would fall and potentially rip off the, the bark of the tree and expose it to the elements, so we don't want that to happen. So after we've done that, then it's time to do the top cut. Top cut, we just start cutting a little bit further away outside of that cut until the limb falls. Of course, this limb's gonna fall now, so clear the area. Make sure you have no little kids running around. Everybody's well away from the landing zone, and we're gonna get into that top cut. The top cut. All right, so now we got the stub left. Do we leave it? No, we cut it off. We need to cut it off back to where the imaginary line is drawn between the branch bark ridge and the branch collar. You can see the branch bark ridge creates this little ridge here where the bark kind of pinches. You'll see it on a lot of trees. That one's easier to identify, but the branch collar is down here. That one's not as easy on a lot of trees, but it kind of swells out and kind of creates this horizontal line like this. So you're gonna draw an imaginary line between here and there, and that's going to be where we make the third and final cut to remove the stub. You ready? All right, here we go. Oh! Voila, we have made the cut. All right, three cuts and it's gone. I did it. Ha <laughs> ha! See ya, limb. All right. So, I encourage you to read Mike Wilson's article if you haven't already. Check it out at russeltreeexperts.com slash arbored. The link's down below. Uh, I appreciate your time. Three cuts, everybody. It's that simple. Be safe. Have a good one.